Congressman, I want to ask you about some of the rhetoric being used here. Republican presidential candidate Ron DeSantis is vow vowing to leave suspected drug smugglers, quote, stone cold dead at the southern border if he's elected president. Here's mm. what he said on Friday in Atlanta. We are going to authorize the use of deadly force against the cartels. If you have somebody coming in with the fentanyl on their in the backpack, they even break through the border wall where there is wall. Uh, if they're doing that, uh, that's the last thing they, they're going to be able to do because we're going to leave them stone cold dead at the border. Um, what? All right. So uh, this sounds like um, Donald Trump talking about shooting people in the legs outside the White House or, or down at the border. Uh, what, what's your response uh, to that? Look, and, um, look, and look, the Ron DeSantis campaign is circling the drain and he's trying to talk tough to try to be a clone of, of Donald Trump and people that talk tough. Uh, usually it's because they don't have experience or, or it, with a particular issue. And, and look, there, there's some nuance in this. Um, could we be working with the Mexican government uh, to help address drug trafficking organizations that are killing Americans and killing Mexicans? Uh, absolutely, but that requires a partnership. Mexico is our, our most important uh, trade partner. Now, I will say, under the current administration, the bilateral relationship between the United States and, and Mexico is the worst that it's ever been. Um, we should be using intelligence in order to target the infrastructure and, and destroy uh, destroy the infrastructure that is moving people and product um, into the illegal product like drugs into the country. Um, fentanyl, I, I think fentanyl should be treated like a, a, a WMD, a, a weapon of mass destruction. We wouldn't allow precursor elements of a dirty bomb into the country. Why are we letting a poison that has killed 109,000 Americans last year into the country? Mm -hmm. But 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 we need to be articulating real strategies and. And unfortunately, uh, people that think they've been to the border once, um, that that's uh, understanding right. of the border. Every, every mile of the border is different. Uh, and look, the northern border, I'm the only candidate yeah. that's actually been to the northern border. Um, in the last nine months, we've seen the number of apprehensions in the northern border increase more than the last nine years. Um, that's a problem. We need serious people that are going to work across the aisle and work with our partners around the world to solve this, to solve this particular issue. And that's why I'm running for president. Okay. So if people like that, former, go to herforamerica.com. All right. For former Texas congressman and Republican presidential candidate, Will Hurd. Thank you very much for coming Thank on you. this morning.